Algo, no sé. ¡Ay! ¡Oh, my! What up, AOK Mafia? It's your boy, RD Kicks, and just like that, we back with another one. Alright, y'all, so it's time for another five ghosts caught on camera type of thing. Wait, hold on, what is this called? This is five scary ghost videos from very haunted places. Oh, crap. Anyway, look, I right, y'all, my, my chair's a little less squeaky right now. Put some Dago WD-40 on it, so it should, you know, scare me a little bit less. Maybe I won't turn back and look behind me as much. I see white people. Anyway, we're about to get into this video. Y'all boys and girls ready? I'm ready. Ignore the merch. Yeah, it's. I, I know it looks good on me. Thank you very much for the compliments. No, don't look good on you. Nobody's talking to you. I, I, Go hide. Look, shut up. Close your door. I'm I filming. Have I am speech. filming. I have a right to say what I gotta say. But but you gonna be modeling for me, so you might as well shut your mouth. You look stupid right now. You gonna be modeling for me. You can you can suck these nuts. Close the door. Anyway, y'all. Close the door. I thought you were going to say your favorite line. I'm waiting for you to close the door. I did. No, you didn't. It's still open. Close the dang old door. Anyway, so back to what... That's what I thought. So back to what I was saying. I forgot what I was saying. It don't matter. We're about to get into this video now. Oh, yeah. I do remember what I was... Hey, shut up. I'm a... Oh, my God. I'm going to shoot him. He get on all my nerves. See, this is why I like to do this. Remember in my last video, I told y'all I like to do this when he's not here? This is why. Sounds like a person See, he took the day off of work. I wish he didn't because he's getting on all my nerves. All of them. So much Shut up! I'm freak. Just wait till I finish this video. You're going to wish. He going to wish. But anyway, but yeah, let's get into this video. Boys and girls, ready? I'm ready. Sorry about that. Let's go. Out by ghosts, caught on camera. Terrifying toys. Oh, shit. Paranormal investigator Eddie McCowan from the YouTube channel Sooth Paranormal got a call from his longtime friend Lee about some odd occurrences that had taken place in his home. Hold on. Got some phone call about some odd occurrences taking place in his home. That reminds me, y'all was I told y'all to leave me alone. I had so many messages from all over the place, Instagram, Twitter, here on YouTube. Folks was telling me y'all saw some orbs in my last video. And y'all said they wasn't moving like dust. They was moving kind of I don't know. Y'all was leaving me all kind of crazy timestamps. If there are any spirits in here, they're good spirits because I don't feel haunted. I feel I feel like I'm being watched, you know, and it's protecting me, whatever it is. But anyway, I just had to say that. The house has a creepy haunted history, and several witnesses have experienced paranormal activity while visiting the residence. Eddie's friend Lee decided to try out some strange experiments and had purchased a few dolls to try and trigger any ghostly activity in the hopes of capturing it on video. It worked. Yeah, I know I hate dolls. How do they fake that? Like this little, this little, what is he, a clown? He was sitting up there. You saw him. He was kind of hanging off for a second before he dropped all the way. I don't see how you fake that. I don't see no strings. Y'all see strings? Nope, you don't see no strings. So don't tell me you see some strings. Y'all lying. Y'all lying. Y'all don't know. Y'all don't know. I don't know. Wait, hold on. The dog's still going to move. He done fell off the dang old shelf already. <sighs> Where he going? 
doing? He trying to go somewhere. That doll is going to get up and walk around the house. After Lee shows Eddie the disturbing footage, Eddie, as a skeptical paranormal investigator, goes to Lee's house to check it out for himself. They set up the creepy dolls around a Ouija board. The same dolls, y'all put them around the Ouija board. Y'all, look, I had folks saying that I should do a video where I go to a haunted house or something. I think the closest ones near me, like the, the ones that got some good activity, is in South Carolina. They say I should bring a Ouija board. You, no. I'm not bringing a Ouija board. I'm not even going to go. Then again, I might. That does kind of sound interesting. I'll vlog it, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I'll bring y'all with me. I don't know. I don't know. Or and start recording. Then, this happens. If so, she's ready. Did you see that? That's pretty Did that just move? Whoa. Oh, uh, okay. uh -huh. no, man. Like, I, no, <laughs> I mean, ain't messing with that. Heck no. Nah. I'm right here. I'm it's moving by itself. What? What? That just moved on its own. That just moved on its own. Where'd it go? Oh my god! It just attacked you. It just attacked you. It was a trash to you. It was attached to you, man. It literally was attached to you like it was stuck to you like tape. I wish I could have I wish I could have caught that. What the As you can tell from Eddie's weird reaction, what? he's more than a look What? Nope, I never ever ever playing with a Ouija board. Nope. Little freaked out. He says that at the time he checked for strings, thinking that his friend Lee might be pulling a prank on him. But he couldn't find anything to explain what he had just witnessed. Wow. To this day, after many investigations, Eddie of Sooth Paranormal says he has never experienced anything like what happened that night. The video remains unexplained. And continuing with the... I would have been afraid that all them dolls would just look up and all turn their head. Ooh, I just imagine <laughs> every last one of those dolls rising up and just looking at me you know what I would have did I would have shit on myself and fainted <laughs> I wouldn't know what to do I wouldn't know if I could run I'd probably be stuck frozen uh uh nope not me not me the video remains unexplained and continuing with the theme of haunted dolls. Oh, this, this video was sent in by Nuke's top five viewer, Joel Bruce. He says his niece was filming her younger sister who had found one of her old dolls and decided to play with it outside their home. What happens next is truly bizarre. The doll seems to turn its head to look at the young girl who doesn't even notice. The incident was so unexpected that the sister is actually zooming the camera away as it takes place. But I'll try to stabilize the video and keep it zoomed as much as I can. Yo! Another creepy doll video was- That's crazy! I don't know if I'm gonna have. I don't know if I'm gonna let my my daughters play with dolls. I don't. I feel perplexed right now. I don't know. I don't know. I just don't know. <laughs> if you're a parent, and you're watching this. Go check them dolls. Go check all the dolls in your house. You know what's crazy? There's a closet right here, and I have like a bunch of those like real fashionable. Um, porcelain dolls, like a box of them. It's maybe like, I don't know how many, 10 of them in there. You know the ones that look creepy? They don't, they look nice, but they look kind of like creepy at the same time. 
I have a bunch of those. I was going to sell them on Amazon, but I, I never got around to it. I don't really know what to do with them now. I was thinking about doing a prank on my roommate because I think he's afraid of dolls. I'm going to set up a camera and see if I can get them. <laughs> it might happen. I might do it. Then by TikTok user Liliana Castillo. In the video, her daughter Golly can be seen playing with her doll. Everything is fine until she seems to hear something odd that catches her attention. Uh oh. Aunt Joanna, how is this a video to you? Good? Okay, thank you. Okay. Yeah, thank you so much, Kellyana. You are a good sport. So, Kellyana, what? What? It sounded like she she got this look on her face like she heard something, but I didn't hear nothing. Did y'all hear anything? Now she's looking at the doll. What? Yo, okay, they boosted the background audio. This girl done went running to her mom. Clearly, she sounds distraught. She's like, Mom, Mom. She said the doll moved his head. Hold on. Did y'all see that? You are a good sport. So, Kellyanne, let me see. What? Let's see. Hold on. Let's see. Look. Oh my God. The doll did move his head. Oh, y'all, I felt that. I felt like this tingling sensation <laughs> it all it was like all in my neck oh did you see it yes watch closely right at the corner of the screen right when golly appears to hear something to her left the doll turns its head to look at her Horrified, Golly runs to her mom to tell her what happened. The doll has since been thrown out in the trash. That's crazy. Marbles. That is crazy. Yo, I oh, mm -mm. nope, nope, nope. Museum Museo de Horror, located in Saltillo, Mexico, often uploads their own paranormal investigations to their YouTube channel and Facebook page. In this investigation, museum director Alejandro Mortem explores an abandoned park in the middle of the night and streams it live on Facebook. He soon begins to hear strange sounds, almost like pebbles or stones falling on the steps all around him. Hay algún espíritu o entidad que se encuentra en este lugar que quiera manifestarse ahora, que quiera hablar conmigo. No sé si es una piedra. Ya dan dos veces que lo escucho. Yeah. Otra vez, no Yo, it definitely sound like some little pebbles or stones are being thrown around around him. I mean, it's so dark he could be doing that himself, but. Una piedra. No sé qué sea. Se escuchó que cayó por acá. After a while, Alejandro finally realizes what the sounds are. Marbles. No sé. Es una no sé si es eso lo que está aventando. No sé. Someone or something is dropping marbles close to Alejandro's feet. What happens next is downright chilling. Hay alguien aquí en este lugar. Algo, no sé. Ay. Oh my.
Yo, that's the second time. That's the second time <laughs> I freaked out and paused the video. I didn't do that on purpose. My hand just kind of it was a reflection and it just <laughs> You just see the little hand reach out from under him and grab the marble? Oh, I felt that in my back. What happens next? Look. Is downright chilling. I wasn't expecting that. Look. Hay alguien aquí en este lugar. Algo, no sé. Ay, cabrón, que chingados fue eso. No mames, que chingados fue eso. Que chingados fue. Que fue. Nah, my reaction would have been, ah, I would have been on my tippy toes and I would have been looking for that thing. I don't know if I believe this, man. I don't know if I believe this. He got me for a second. What looks like the small hand of a child grabs one of the marbles that has fallen near Alejandro's feet. He spins around, but there's no one there. He Is this the ghost of a child still playing with marbles at the abandoned park? Or... Is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. Meanwhile, on TikTok. I don't know, y'all. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and, and, and say that's a hoax. I'm going to say that's a hoax. Because um, it was live. You know, he did do that on Facebook Live. So, considering the fact that he did it on Facebook Live, we're kind of, the you know, determining just how much enthusiasm he would have about jumping up and down and looking to point that camera everywhere. He didn't do that. He only kind of panned it to the right and looked out a little bit, you know? I don't know. He got me for a second. He got me. Andy Sauces Camase is trying to record a video for TikTok when he spots something truly chilling. Whoa, whoa! The face of a little girl seems to be peeking out at Andy from behind his wardrobe. However, when Andy checks the area, no one there. Not only is there no one in the space, but Andy demonstrates in a follow-up video how no one could have even been sitting in this narrow area to begin with. Voy a aclarar. That's what I'm saying. That's what I thought too. I'm like, that don't even look like a spot that anybody could be in. Yo, what the f So, what do you look at that? Cause it looks like it's perfectly aligned. It looks like it's up against the wall in the way that it should be. It doesn't look like it's far away, yo. No, I don't know about this. I don't know about this, y'all. That's creepy. Think. Is this the ghost of a little girl, or is it just a very good fake? It might be a good fake because they got a white face and everything. Like, they might have been able to do this really good, but they sold it. They sold it. They sold it very well. Go oh, down in the comments. TikTok user Rubik's Cube was bored and home alone when he decided to learn a dance and record it for TikTok. Now, keep in mind, he says he was home alone at the time and has no pets. It's getting closer to me. Whoa. Now this creepy video went viral, and it was sent in by viewers of my channel so many times that I felt it had to have a spot in this week's top five. However, it was a different video posted by Rubik's Cube that really caught my attention. During renovations of his house, he recorded this chilling footage. Whoa. Someone or something seems to be standing behind the see-through curtains. And then when he, he pans, pans back, back, only seconds later, the creepy nothing there is now gone. Is it a ghost or a TikTok hoax? You decide. 
Why? Wow. Flight. I don't know, man. I know. I know. With TikTok, you can do these little slick edits. I, that's why I like the app. It's like it's very. You can get real creative with it, but I don't know. I don't know. I almost feel like I can sense where the cut might have occurred, but it did a really smooth transition. If the cut was anywhere, it was right there, because the the colors almost seem to kind of shift differently as well. TikTok, right there. It's kind of hard to pinpoint it. You know, I would have to use my video editing software to kind of really slow it down, frame by frame. The ghost or TikTok hoax? Yeah. You decide. I don't know, man, because I feel like for him to go back to that room then it's because he saw something there but he quickly panned back to the left i don't i don't know man taking flight now i've tried to find the original source of this video but with no luck all that is known about this mysterious clip is that it was recorded at the now empty el dorado airport in bogota colombia a guy is walking around completely alone when he hears strange sounds coming from the airport's bathroom Bueno, estoy nuevamente aquí en la puerta del baño. No hay nadie acá. I hear banging. No hay nadie. You hear it? I know he's I know I got him talking kind of loud, but I want y'all to be able to hear what I hear as well. Bang is like increasing, it's getting faster. Poco y nadie. No nadie allá. Dios mío. I don't know where it's coming from. La sangre de Cristo me cura. He said he's going in. I ain't going nowhere. Hola. Hola, hola, estás acá? ¿Dónde estás? Se prenden las luces. ¿Estás jugando con la llave? ¿Ah? ¿Estás jugando con la llave? ¿Ah? Necesito otra prueba. Yo, what? What you mean you need more proof? The sink is turning on and off for one. The hand dryers are turning on and off by themselves. That's all the proof I need to get the hell up out of there. Nope. Nope. Necesito otra prueba. Yeah, I almost ran out of this room just now. I saw some type of shadow and now this door is closing. And I don't see any feet. Necesito otra prueba. Ay, marica. Yeah, I'm with you, bro. <laughs> that thing closed on its own. Nah, nah, nah. I'm, nope. Leave the airport alone. Now, it's hard enough to get one of these automatic faucets to work when you want them to. Right. So it seems like it would be very difficult to fake this for a video. But what do you think? Is it real? Or just a very elaborate hoax. You decide. I don't know. Cobb Mansion. On the YouTube ghost hunting channel, The Haunted Side, lead investigator Patrick. Yeah, give me a second. <laughs> that got me. That got me. That door closed on his own like that. Uh, -uh. hold on. I think I might have to take a little break from these videos, y'all. I've been doing them like every day for almost a week now. Can I have a break, y'all? Y'all gonna let me have a break or y'all want me to keep doing this? I ain't had no nightmares yet. But if they come, I'm stopping. I'm stopping. Look. <laughs> I ain't about to play with y'all. On the YouTube ghost hunting channel, The Haunted Side, lead investigator Patrick, his friend Jeremy, and cameraman Jason are investigating the 140-year-old Cobb Mansion in Virginia City, Nevada. The mansion was built on a lot where long ago a small home was lost in the Great Fire of 1875, a fire which burned down most of Virginia City, Nevada. 
The new owners of Cobb Mansion have reported multiple incidents of intense paranormal activity inside what is now the Cobb Mansion Bed and Breakfast. When Patrick and his team start investigating, it becomes clear that something just doesn't want them there. What the? Is this the room where you worked? What was that? That just hit me in the jaw. What was that? I don't know. What the? Is this the room where you worked? What was that? That just hit me in the jaw. I'm not kidding you, it hit me in the jaw. I know, I, I like, I heard it bounce off of you and then land on the floor. <gasps> what is that, dude? No. What is that, a dude, rock? It was underneath this stuff. How the hell did it get underneath that? What is that, a rock? I don't know. Or a tooth? No, it's a rock. It's a rock. What the heck? This man had a rock hit him in the jaw. What the heck? Their investigation downstairs, one of their static cameras is recording the upstairs hallway. They capture chilling footage of something they can't explain. We head back downstairs to continue the investigation, and once I review this footage, realize we captured something unbelievable. Whoa. What's really strange about this is that the book hovers in place for several minutes before falling to the ground. And when we head back upstairs to get this night vision camera, we find out that whatever's up here wasn't finished yet. Oh! Dude, it fell! It fell! Whoa! Dude, it fell! It fell! Whoa! Okay. Now, just a bit shaken what? up, they head back downstairs. And this is when things get truly bizarre. And it's still <laughs> going. They. St no. Y'all saw the book? It just. It didn't fail. And then the dang on the ladder fell. What in the world? Are you? I feel like a, a breeze of coldness. What is that, Patrick? What do you see? I just saw literal. My throat is like a whole me. being walk by, and I heard it. Did you see that? This the the night vision. This just died. It just come. Everything's dying oh, right now. Hey guys. Oh. Everything's dying. All right, let's go, oh. guys. Let's go. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Do you see it moving? Yep. There was like a scream. This oh, God, just. Please. Let's go. Let's go. Come let's on. Go. Did you see it? No. As all really... of their equipment starts to fail, a tall dark shadow can be seen going no, from right to left at the end of the hallway. Yeah, I saw that. Oh, God. Let's go. Let's go. Do you see it moving? Yeah, I saw that. Yep. Oh, God. Let's go. Let's yep. Go. yep. Do you see it moving? Nope. Yep. Nope. What nope. makes this footage even more compelling is that just earlier, cameraman Jason had seen the same tall shadow at the other end of the hallway. We head downstairs to start the sensory deprivation experiment, but before the cameras were even rolling, Jason sees something that absolutely terrifies him. The guys were walking up the stairs to sensory deprivation. It was literally standing at that door. There was a, there was a legit figure just standing right here. Sorry. It was literally just standing right here. Like I got full body chills right now. Like can barely handle it full body chills. How tall was it? Taller than you. Like by maybe a foot. Oh God. Let's go. Let's go. Do you see moving? Yeah, I saw that. Oh God. Let's go. Let's go. For for moving? them to see it and us to see it on camera as well. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yep. So, did Patrick and his team capture a ghost on camera? You decide. You can check out the full investigation over on their YouTube channel, The Haunted Side, Paranormal Investigations. Y'all, look, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm almost tempted to go. I'm almost tempted to go somewhere, somewhere that's supposedly haunted and, and, and see for myself. 
because I, I don't know. I don't know what's real. I don't know if they're faking this stuff. I don't know. I don't know if I got big enough balls to go do that. <laughs> but I don't know. We're going to keep watching these and we're just going to be 50 50. I'm just going to be 50 50 with, it, with all of these. They could be real, they could be fake. I do not know. But I enjoy them though, nonetheless. <laughs> Yo, they just be having me on edge, bro. I swear. I just, that's all I see. I don't see nothing else around me until I look at you guys. I just, it's like I'm there. Whoo, nope. Uh uh. Anyway, y'all know what time it is. If you like this reaction, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, stay tuned for more. As always, the link to the original is going to be down in the description box below. If you haven't already, make sure you follow your boy here on the ground, man. Tune in on the kicks. To the next one.